Hi, it's Steve from Part Select. Today we're going to show you how to clean your drip coffee maker. Although you can purchase products commercially to do that job, we're going to show you how some of the common ingredients that you have around your home can get your coffee maker sparkling clean and looking like new. Regularly cleaning your drip coffee maker is an important thing. First of all, there's the chance that you can have bacteria build up in surfaces that are not easily accessible. As well, you can also find minerals in water supplies that will typically tend to build up in areas that are not easily cleanable. Before we do a deep clean cycle, we should remove all the items that are easily removable, such as a reusable filter, a filter holder and valve assembly, and the carafe itself. And these we can simply wash using liquid dish detergent and hot water. Once you're done washing these, make sure you rinse them thoroughly and allow them to dry. So we're going to go ahead and use the denture tab cleaning method on this particular drip coffee maker. So we'll begin by pouring in a full carafe of water. We'll replace the carafe and then we'll simply add our denture cleaning tablets. Now that we've added our denture tabs and we can see they're starting to foam a little bit, We'll close up the coffee maker and start a normal cycle. Now that we've allowed that coffee maker to go through a complete cycle, we'll inspect the contents of the carafe. And you can see that there is some slight discoloration of that water, which is typical of the mineral content that would have been inside the tubing of your coffee maker. We can discard this pot of water we suggest then that you at least put one or two full carafes of water through your coffee maker without using any coffee and then do a taste test on that. If you find you have a residue of a denture cleaner tab taste or a vinegar, if you've used that method, you'll again want to rinse it one more time and we suggest that you take some lemon juice, either freshly squeezed or the commercial type lemon juice Put about a tablespoon or two of that in the water, run it through a cycle, and then rinse it a couple of times after that, and that should remove all of that residue. All that remains now is to clean the exterior of your coffee maker, and it'll be just like new. Any of the methods that we've shown you here today should work fine for your coffee maker, but if you have a favorite method, be sure to share it with us in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching this video. For more appliance repair and cleaning tips, be sure to check out our YouTube channel and subscribe so you're always up to date.